What's up guys, Minty here, another Mass Effect 3 gameplay, this time with the Solarian Infiltrator. This is the only Solarian I use. The Engineer, I don't really like him, but the Solarian Infiltrator is bar none the best sniper in the game. Period. Best sniper in the game. Equipment for this gameplay, ammo piercing rounds 3. I actually had no idea what enemy we were facing, and it turns out... I got lucky, and we were facing Cerberus. Yes, that is who we were facing. We were facing Cerberus. Yes, I have all my facts right in front of me, as you can see. Uh, power efficiency mod module. module. Uh, three gives me faster recharge speed. Definitely useful for cloak. I don't think the sniper rifle isn't too bad for recharge speed, but just nice to have faster recharge speed in general. Use your abilities more. Uh, sniper Rifle Amp 3, this is, I barely use sniper, I barely ever use sniper rifles, so I have a shitload of these, which is kind of the reason I wanted to play this class and record it, I wasn't expecting a great gameplay, and when we started on the map, I was like, fuck, I am going to do terrible on this match, turns out it's gonna turn out to, turns out it's gonna, I'm just gonna keep saying turns out, cause it turns out that it turns out, um, this gameplay is actually one of my best gameplays I've ever had, in my opinion. I mean, I love the Geth Trooper, I love the Turian Havoc Infiltrator, and I can do really good on those two. But this gameplay, I was absolutely amazed at myself. I thought I was going to do the worst on the team, and I come in clutch quite a few times. Oh, like I said, I think a few weeks back or whenever I fucking upload these. Um, there, I recorded a f five of these games in one night. And out of the five games, I'm pretty sure we only extracted like once or twice. Um, maybe three times. But this one, we don't get the extraction, but I love, absolutely love the gameplay. I was so shocked at myself. So, hopefully you guys will enjoy this. Hopefully. I mean, maybe. Maybe not. Maybe you'll just call me a fucking noob. Well, fuck you! Uh, finish it off, gear bonus. Operate package 3, more sniper rifle damage, and more tech damage. Because this guy is very technical. Moving on. Weapons. I know a lot of people are like, oh, use the fucking Black Widow. It's the fucking best. Yeah, I have it. I also have the Crisy Rifle, Crazy Rifle, however the fuck you say it. I have a Collector Rifle, which sucks, I guess. I don't know. Some people like it. I have a Widow 9. I don't know. Fuck it. I don't, I don't like the Widow. You only get one shot. I have the Javelin 3. Like, I have so many good sniper rifles. And I was like, nah, fuck it. I'm going to use the Kishok. Because why? I'm trying to get that fucking challenge. So, I'm using Kishok. I got armor piercing on it and increased damage. I believe 5 and 2. Which isn't bad. I mean, I do more damage, which is good. I pierce through armor, which is good. And, I don't know, I like the look of this gun. It doesn't look like a harpoon gun. It looks, it's rugged. I like it. It doesn't make any sense on a Solarian Infiltrator because they're like... Super technical when they're like fucking amphibians and shit. But recharge speed is 67%. Not too bad. My recharge speed is, I don't know, average, I guess you would say. Um, On to the powers. I really like his powers. It works for a sniper. Tactical cloak, definitely. You don't need fucking duration. Fuck that. Whoever uses duration is, I don't know, fucking stupid, I guess. Uh, damage bonus, incredible. Why the fuck would you be melee? You don't need that. Recharge speed, excellent. Don't need that. Definitely don't need that when you want sniper rifle damage by 25%. 65% extra damage is beautiful when you uncloak. Absolutely beautiful. I don't go for max proxy mine. I know Proxy Mine has a debuff. Actually, I just realized that I don't have the debuff for this character. 
That sucks. I might have to redo this guy. All right. Fuck it. I use damage, and I'll probably get debuff the next time I use this guy. Because that is beautiful. Beautiful ability. The uh, Geth Infiltrator can rape with this debuff. Fuck, I didn't realize that. All right. Um, energy Drain. Great ability. I don't use it on the Paladin because there's no need. This guy is much more flimsy, so definitely go for impact radius, pull more shields. Next, I went for drain. That is so deceiving. It's called en energy drain drain. Uh, yeah, definitely want to, uh, the, the, I can't talk. Definitely want to restore your shields. It's fucking amazing. I mean, why not? You survive much better if you do that. And then, again, I go for the boost in shields and also draining and giving me 100% shields restored. Very useful. Uh, it saves me quite a few times in this. Just immediately gives me my shields back. Uh, Solarian Operative, all weapon damage. All weapon damage. Yep. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. Fitness. I use fitness. I guess I'll probably take this away and probably take this one away and put it back in or put it into Proxy Mine. Uh, proxy Mine is very good for that debuff. And I put the health and shield bonus in because I really wanted, I wanted to stay alive more. I didn't want just like, what is it? Probably it's around like 600 for like it's 600 for health and like probably around 750 for shields uh i wanted to stay alive a bit more on this character i had a problem before but i guess i'll have to make do and definitely get that debuff the debuff is key i strongly suggest at least going to rank 5 damage taken on proxy mine proximity mine proxy mine fuck it abbreviations but as i was saying this guy is number one sniper in the game. Highly recommend using this guy for the sniper rifle and not many others. I know my first commentary on Mass Effect 3, uh, there was a Turian Havoc infiltrator using a sniper rifle. That's cool and all, but unlike him, you don't, from Tactical Cloak, you get assault rifle damage here, not sniper rifle damage. So why the fuck would you use a sniper rifle? That that kid was just so dumb. But anyways, uh, let's get into the gameplay. It's bar none my favorite one, so I hope you guys enjoy. Alright guys, this is Solarian Infiltrator, Kishok, Kishik, whatever, Kishok, Sniper Rifle, on Firebase Jade with Cerberus. I'm using a sniper rifle on Firebase Jade. God, I was, I was pretty upset when I saw his Firebase Jade because this map is small and not very friendly towards snipers. And I'm not <laughs> the greatest with the sniper rifle. Um, I usually a lot of my shots are very lucky, and I'm down. Yeah, I was pretty, <laughs> I was just laughing at this point. I was like, there's no way in hell we are doing this. There's no way in hell that we are getting through this. Um, yeah, that guy's already executed too. <laughs> this was probably the worst start to any match I've been in in a long time. Tony's uh, being Mr. Tank over here for us. And I get my first kill. Look at that. Fucking incredible. There's another one. So, the thing I like about this gun, or this, it's like the gun in the class. I've used this gun in class multiple times now. Um, it's one of my favorite snipers. I said it in the uh, build. Like, I just like the look of it. I like, I'm not a big fan about charging guns, but... It works. I, I don't know. It just works for this one, I think. Um, it does a shitload of damage. And I, I just... 
I find this gun more enjoyable using than the Black Widow. I, I feel like it also has a faster recharge speed, and it also fucking just slings enemies. Um, there's Cryo Explosion. We actually do have an N7 Paladin with us, which is pretty cool. Uh, Tony's, like I said, being Mr. Tank, bright green tank, and uh, I can't remember what the other guys use. What the other guy used. But as you can see, I'm having some trouble with um, with this class and this map. Uh, the other guy's X Tarbus, believe Vanguard. But it takes me a little bit to get back into the rhythm of actually shooting and killing with this class. Um, I do like the Slayer Infiltrator. I'm not bashing the class. Um, he is... Yeah, there. I'm at the bottom of the leaderboard. I'm like, yeah, this is going great. Um, here, I'm going to try and get some kills. Right there, total miss, like always. Nothing new there. But um, I'm going to definitely try milk this. I know the other two are very adamant. And I uh, want to do... Oh, this is great. I get three... Three Nemesis headshots in a row. No big deal. Um, but I really I like this map, but I don't like it for this class. Um, that's the one problem I have with unknown unknown. If this was like <laughs> if this was on Firebase Jade and on uh, against collectors, I probably would have just quit. Um, it's kind of a ridiculous combination here I'm when I was playing this I thought my proxy mine had the debuff on it so I was like all right cloak proxy and then Kishok um, unfortunately it doesn't but that doesn't stop this gun from totally fucking raping an atlas sure it takes a few shots but it's I love it there for some reason I don't I don't know I I like hit the nemesis and it didn't do really much of anything and right there I hit him but that didn't do much of anything either but when you do get a headshot it is just over for pretty much every enemy you see so these guys, those two, are just uh, I don't know, hanging out in here. Uh, Tony and I are kind of just running around, clearing out some enemies, trying to get just points. Um, there, I kill Tony or steal Tony's kill because I'm a dick. Uh, <laughs> here, I, I don't know what I was doing. Yeah, this is this is pretty bad. Reload. Somehow I get a tech burst. All right, not complaining, I guess. <laughs> yeah, zoom in. I don't think you have to zoom in for a fucking atlas. Um, uh, this, I, I feel like these guys could do. They're doing pretty good, but it, we're still like, take cover if you're being shot. Like he was the person that was being shot at during that time and he just like I don't know I don't know what he does he just sits there and takes it like take cover definitely take cover um, but I don't know. not everyone I guess plays gold all the time or knows how to play on gold I'm still at the bottom of the leaderboard but at this point I'm like all right I mean that's obvious very obvious that I'm gonna be at the bottom um, luckily, all the enemies spawn over here. Somehow, I don't kill that engineer. Well, I get the kill on the Centurion. There's a shitload of enemies spawning right now. I uh, save Tony from dying. Tony's now bitching at me for stealing all of his kills, even though they're tech bursts. And uh, then I realized the Phantom spawned. Um. When I played against Cerberus before with this build, I wasn't 
Phantoms aren't much of a problem as long as they're not close to me. If they're close to me, yeah, I'll get fucking destroyed. But just like that, it's pretty easy to uh, survive with this character. Granted, you uh, actually get some of the shields. Unlike dragoons who just use armor. <sighs> Sandy dies again. Sandy kills. I don't know if that's like an abbreviation or something. Um, but there. <laughs> knock that guy out of the park. Revive this guy. And of course, fucking dragoon. Who would have thunk? Yep. 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 And then this guy goes and executes him, and then he comes over to execute me, and I'm like, nope. I have zero missiles, zero op packs, and only three medigel. And now it's only Tony and I left. But, thankfully, that's the end of the wave. So, I'm getting a bit concerned now, because I'm like, alright, we're all just going down a lot. Um... I don't know how well this is going to end up. And I was... I, from the beginning, I was like, All right, there's no way in hell we're going to be able to do this. But... How, somehow... Somehow I turn on, like, pro mode later on, and... You know, from doing really poorly to actually doing really good. Which is still very surprising to me. I'm still surprised thinking about how much I love this match even though I was complaining and like laughing about how bad it was gonna be because I'm, u I'm using a sniper rifle on a very small map with a lot of obstacles in front of me like sure yeah the Alice's I can hit no problem but it's still like there's some things are just like no, like this is this is not a combination I would like for this map. But we take down that atlas, and then Tony's I think takes down a turret or is taken down by a turret. Maybe not yet. But Tony has an issue with turrets this match, and like I go to like revive him, and he doesn't tell anyone about the fucking turret. And kind of just like, what? Another thing I hate is that I use energy drain a lot more than I use um, the proxy mine. But you also have to charge up this gun. So I'll end up like charging it, having to like switch fingers mid, mid charge. And like I have to tap my uh, right button to get the shield drain decloak. That's kind of a pain, but that's just me being picky at this point. Um, it's not really a big issue. That might be a downfall for you, might not. No, I really, really like this class. Um, it's pretty. It's good if you know if you can use it properly. It's good. It's really, really good. And yeah, Tony, Tony couldn't handle the heat from a, an atlas. Typical. Apparently, I couldn't revive him there. But after that wave, I was like, "All right, yeah, we'll be fine." I was like, "Oh shit! How how am I like? How did I like pass the person? How did I catch up to someone?" That's why I'm like, "All right, maybe maybe I'll do pretty good." Um, here, I'm not worried about. Uh, the guy at all. I'm kind of just doing my own thing. That little bitch dodged me. <laughs> but see, even that she has half her shields, and she's she's dead. She is dead. Miss, it's. I'm pretty sure like only half of my shots hit. Like I'm just, I I'm terrible most of the time. This bitch somehow doesn't die. But fuck you, energy drain, bitch. What you know about energy drain? Nothing. Then somehow I like miss her armpit. It's cool. Tony, I'm like, don't 
fucking die. I swear to God, if you get stabbed, it's going to be the end of us. And he's like, no, 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 no we'll be fine. I'm like, no, I don't think so. But there's, yeah, that's f turrets. They, the engineers know where to fucking put the turrets in this match. They are fucking relentless with the turrets. Absolutely fucking ridiculous with the turrets. Right, I'll get up. And look, there's no one knew there was a turret behind us. Like, of course we're going to get fucked by a turret. And then, random phantom, no idea where she was. Um, I'm like looking around, like, what the fuck? Um, fucking teleport away, alright. That guy goes up there, and I'm like, oh, you are so dumb. No, I hate that ladder. I only use that ladder to jump down. And even then, it's like, not, not even worth it. Uh, another phantom, this guy. So like about to get stabbed and we get a tech burst. Luckily for him. Another fucking nemesis. Fucking This gun is so accurate. What am I doing? Just fuck why? Oh my god, I, it's pissing me off watching me try to play this. What is hitting me? So there, there's her, and then I revive this guy. This guy's, I don't know what the fuck he's doing. There, there's a lot of points in this map where I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Um, kill that guy, revive this guy. Um, then I realize there's a turret behind me. I hate that. Turrets, like, look at where that turret is placed. That turret can hit fucking everything. Literally. F fucking everything. Like, it's... The AI were so smart when they placed their turrets down in this match. It was crazy. Uh, fucking go flying, alright. And then we get a tech burst. Ah, man. Yeah, I'm like... <laughs> I passed those two. I'm almost up to uh, Tony. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Like, this is like mediocre sniping at best. And I'm keeping up with Tony. Like, the thing about that Krogan is that, like, you, you're you supposed to just, like, you take a lot of damage and you deal a lot of damage. Like, that's... So when he was only, like, right above me, I was like, holy shit, what is going on? And that guy runs right past me. And Tony helps me up. I help him up. Here it's, it's starting to get ugly. Tony has. <laughs> that's the one thing I guess that worked out well between us being these two classes was uh, he uh, couldn't really attack like a phantom. If he hit a phantom and uh, he their shields are still up, he wouldn't knock them back and like knock them down where once I take their shields down pretty much just clean up so so when he goes down there's like fucking that there I run over this guy he gets himself up I'm like alright let me bring my attention back over to Tony and this guy like fucking just runs over there that's if we're gonna revive him. It's just like who there's a lot of moments where things went rather poorly for us. And it could have been avoided. There's a lot of careless mistakes. A lot of careless mistakes. Like that. Like I careless. Absolutely careless. Like, thankfully for, um, my ability, and I'm like, oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. This guy goes down, and I'm like, oh, fuck. I'm like, I can't, can't get to you right now. I'm like, trying to get him. And I, I just run away. At this point, I'm like, I'm like, oh, fuck. 
Like, that's an atlas. I'm like, fuck. I'm the last person. I'm like, all right, well, this is all over now. I just all, all attempt to beat this by myself. And I was just running over here. I was like, all right, got ammo. I'm like, looking around. I'm like, all right, I guess there's not too many enemies left. I'm like, see this dipshit over here. Fucking t kill him. This guy, this girl over here. Kill her. I'm like, all right, holy shit. Might actually be able to do this. All three shots, three kills. I'm like, holy shit. Is that, is there anything else? Is that, is it just the Atlas? And uh, Mr. Announcer confirms that the Atlas is left. And I was like, holy shit. I'm going to be able to actually do this. And this was like, when I, when this happened to me, I was like, holy shit. When did I, when did I go from not being able to use a sniper in the bottom of the leaderboard in this match, being the last one standing? And actually being able to kill shit. Like, when I started this match, I got, like, two kills the first wave. That's terrible. And now I'm getting most of the kills per wave. It was just, like, honestly, look at that. I'm 8,000 points ahead of Tony now from just that wave alone. Like, absolutely crazy. And then I immediately, they spawn right behind me. And I start bitching. I'm like, what the fuck? But I can tell that that probably won't happen again. There's no way I could do that if there was like multiple phantoms or multiple or like a dragoon or anything. If there was a dragoon, I would have been fucked. But, um, talk, I'm talking with Tony here, like, cause I really, I really want to be a gold wave. Or a gold match. We haven't beaten that many this you know, when we recorded this that night. I'm getting fucking shot and I'm invisible, pissing me off. And uh I'm like, what the fuck is going on? And then yeah, I didn't I should have just ran, but I didn't and I went down. And um Yeah, this it's steadily falling apart. Um this phantom Fucking way, way too good at cloaking. Running away. This guy. Don't know where this phantom went. Like, the phantoms just. The amount of times they just cloaked and ran away from us. It's ridiculous. And then see there, I took the shields down for Tony. And uh, because of that, really. Uh, it allows him to do a lot more damage. And then here, I'm like, oh, fuck. And then shields are down. And he gets a kill. It's, once we started working together, um, it kind of made our lives a bit easier. Here, he doesn't really want to contend with the uh, Atlas, which is understandable. Um, it's kind of a bitch. And then, expert. Ba I'm back to being, like, the shitty person I was playing as earlier. Oh, look at that, just completely missing. And then this guy, like, I missed two enemies that were, like, right next to each other. I missed again. Like, it's just, like, it's funny that I can go from absolutely owning a wave to just shit. Like, here, here, I, uh, actually, wow, I actually do get someone. I totally took that kill from Tony. Fucking cover him. Use thermal power because, you know, fuck it. I have a shit ton that I just want to use. And I know I'm not. I, Tony, uh, he's trying, like, not to. Uh, and, like, he doesn't want to really use an atlas or go against an atlas right now. That's pretty much all we have left. Like, there's a few few nemesis left, but other than that, it's pretty much down to the atlases that we have left. We have like two atlases, I think. And this gun. Two bars of health, and uh, it's dead. That's, I'm, it's amazing. Like, uh, I can just go from doing really good one way to really bad the next. But this gun, I love. I love this gun and I love this class. I like going against Cerberus too because they're pretty easy as well. 
but this gun in this class just make just have a lot of flow together. I really like these two together. Um, I think once I get my Black Widow up, I'll start using that a bit more. But I'm not really too good with a sniper rifle if you couldn't fucking tell from this video. Like, I, I have a lot of issues with uh, tracking, uh, which is why I usually stay with assault rifles or something like that. Um, like, I usually, a lot of my kills are just lucky. Like that. There, I just quickly get my shields back. Um, and just get the fuck out of there. Didn't feel like dealing with the phantoms and multiple atlases. And then Tony goes down, I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. And then there's a phantom, I'm like, fuck. And then there's a turret, and I'm like, fuck. I, I, I jumped down here and didn't see that turret. And then I used the wrong fucking power. I was so pissed at that. And, um, yeah, Tony gets himself up. And <laughs> that guy goes down. The, oh, I, did I get myself up? Yeah, I must have got myself up. That guy. Right. There, There's teamwork right there. But, um, yeah, this is, it's not bad. I like Guardians because they kind of just, like, look at you. Like, they'll shoot at you, but they pretty much don't move. Which is, uh, awfully convenient. Unlike the Phantom, who just turned around in, like, three fucking seconds. What the fuck? Uh, yeah, you're not stealing my fucking kill, you bitch. I think that's the one thing I like about snipers is that they are the best to use against, uh... Fucking um, guardians, like you do so much damage to guardians with this gun. Once again, the fucking turrets. The fucking turrets are just ridiculous in this match. Absolutely ridiculous. There's just fucking everywhere. Oh, oh yeah, there's some weird ass noise right there. I don't know what that was. Uh, I said that to Tony, but apparently he didn't hear it. And now, all that's left is uh, these two Atlases. Uh, I'm just going to work on these two guys. Whole team's here, so... Should be able to get some good abilities and stuff. I get energy drain use. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Um, here, four people against one Atlas. Just rape. Absolute rape oh man this is just wave 10 god damn I can't believe this uh, this is definitely where it's getting a bit more hairy um, I'm having a hard time seeing where the uh, like objective is I, I know I was actually doing the objective right there here, Tony goes down, I'm like, oh, shit, let me go help him. He's not saying anything, like, he's just like, fuck, I went down. And then it's like, oh, fuck, I was like, fuck, that's a turret. Like, why the fuck didn't you tell me that? Like, oh, I was, <sighs> that was frustrating. Very, yeah, see, the fucking turret there. And that, that turret was just, <sighs> that turret was very, um, I'm expecting this guy. Uh, I s save him. Uh, yeah, this is this gets very, very hairy. Yep. 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 This is. Um, he missiles that. And at this point, I'm kind of, I'm like, oh, fuck. There's three phantoms there. Like, how the fuck are we going to do this? So, roll down here. I have cloak, thankfully. We're the infiltrator with cloak. Um, as of right now, just fucking cut it really close there. I had shot in, like, probably the foot. It didn't do anything. If it was Call of Duty, I probably would have been dead. 
But, uh, yeah, here he goes down. I revive him. Get up. Turret just annihilates me. He gets me up. I get up. Phantom goes down. Fent then. Um. Yeah. And then fucking Phantom. Phantomed. So I get up. Um. I should just run all. Say I run. Like. The fucking Phantoms are ridiculous in this game. Missile launches them, but then is taken down by the fucking turret. If that turret wasn't there, we probably would have done a lot better. But, um, actually, yeah, everyone was taken down by a turret or a phantom. That was our downfall, was those fucking enemies. And then that phantom was camping because he wanted to get the little execution. A little fucking bitch. Can't kill him with the gun. Got to go in for the execution. Fucking piece of shit. But anyways, uh, that, like I said, that's one of my prouder moments in a game. Mostly because of that one wave. Like, it was just, I wasn't expecting to do this well, point-wise, on this map with this class. Like, it's just, when I think of a map to snipe on, I don't think of Firebase Goddess. And I don't think of using the Kishok rifle. Like, it was just, some things just... I was really surprised about how decent this ma this uh, matchup was, I guess. Because, I mean, we didn't complete it. It was uh, rather unfortunate, but what can you do? Alright, guys, I hope you liked this video. Uh, I hope it showed you something new. And uh, I'll see you next time.